Good morning and welcome to another day of the video diary and I'm in the middle of town and it's insanely busy today. This is like the quietest place I can find. We're going to the cinema with some uh, people to go see the Avengers. That's a thing. And I'm trying to be as brave as possible with the vlogging even though I stopped when they walked past. And oh, okay, no. Um, because I want to introduce you to them, essentially. That's what I want to do. Well, technically I'll be introducing them to you as opposed to you to them, but yeah. Um, did I say that? No, you to them, instead of them to you. What? Well, yeah, either way around. Um, because otherwise, that will free me up so that I can follow people I want to follow on Twitter, and also do this more openly in public around Oh! Oh, it's so crap. I'm so suck at life. Suck at this vlogging thing. What the balls was that? That wasn't even an attempt. Oh my god. Look at my elbow when I vlog. That's how I hold the camera. Imagine the camera's there. That's how my elbow looks when I vlog. That's weird, isn't it? It's a tad weird. It looks so... <laughs> well, anyway, yeah, that went well, didn't it? There is no conceivable possible way to just casually introduce this. I tried to do it in a way where I would be, like, caught, to a certain extent, where I would be caught vlogging. Then it's a hell of a lot easier to introduce. But uh, it's impossible. The only conceivable way I can think of doing it is by showing them the videos. In which case you've got that pompous thing where you just go, Hey guys, watch my videos. Watch my... It's so attention seeking, it's just not me. I don't even want them to watch them. Not really. I just want to be able to do this around them so that I can get more interesting memories and shiz. Meniz. I need ideas, man. I need. Uh, we went in, we went to go see the 2D one, and we got there, and then literally as we went to buy our tickets, they sold out. We were like, what? What? No, um, panic, 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 we'll go over there, blah, 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 blah. So we came back and then we went to decide to watch the 3D one. And I know I'm not a fan of 3D, so it makes the first one on the screen look dodgy. You know when it moves really fast? It's just, it may as well not be 3D, because the graphics don't seem to keep up with it, I don't think, it's just... I don't think the projectors are good enough to deal with it. I don't know, to be honest with you. It's just strange that it moves. It moves a lot better between it and three. Um, and a film like that. Um, but it was good. It was a good film. It was really bloody long. And there was a lot of like, yeah, <laughs> what a load of bull. There was a lot. It's definitely a good film. It's worth watching. <laughs> Whether it's worth paying 3D prices for. <laughs> But the whole film, majority of it, Dave Lee, was good. It was basically just a huge explosion fest with like bites and stuff and legitimate things in it where everything is extortionately legit, as Tom said, throughout the entire thing. And then we, the, I suppose I would have been more engaged in it if it was going crooked. But, um, oh. but then also, obviously, because this is the cinema. We ended up with like a row of like eight 11 year olds. And they said they were 11, like, oh, this is a 12 year old, we're 11, lol. And it was literally just a rain of popcorn and them just making really funny fart noises throughout the entire thing. And it was, it was great, but we was in a British, like you could tell that they were ruining the entire film for the entire cinema, but we're so quintessentially British that people were just like, totting, no one did anything about it, so yeah. That was horrible. Then they all left and we were like, yes, yes, and then they all came back again for no apparent reason. They just all left, all came back. So that was weird. But anyway, that film was like two and a half hours long. That's two and a half hours too long out of my busy, busy schedule. So I'm gonna go back now, do some revision. Yay, not Minecraft. In fact, I'm gonna start uploading so that I can't play Minecraft. Force my hand. Cool, oh, blimey, mate, how's it going? Um, whew. Oh, literally haven't spoken to you since thingy, have I? Um, I got in and that film pushed the time back a lot longer than I thought I had. Literally came in, had dinner, then went upstairs and was doing maths and revision and then taking breaks on Minecraft. Um, me and the Tom are on a mission now. We're on a mission on the Minecrafts. And it's the kind of mission where you can kind of do a bit, do a bit of maths. So what I've been doing is I've been working through the devil that is further peel 2 and I'm doing what I did with the D2 book except obviously this is harder than decision and I'm going through the chapters one by one and just going through 
and just remembering the theory. Because there's certain things in this test where it's kind of like, it give you five, it'll give you five marks for a specific thing that if you don't know the method, takes forever to, th to think your way through. You could sit there and figure it out, but it takes too long. So it's easier just to go in and just memorize it to a certain extent. So the first chapter I've been doing is differentiating inverse trigonometric functions. Trigger, trigonometric, which I never realized was spot like that. So it's basically just differentiating tan to the minus one and sine and cos to the minus one. And I just had a bit of fun. I've done um, two pages of revision notes and then I've sat and done like, the first exercise. How have you got a low battery? You was on charge all last night. Have I left you on in my pocket or something? Must have. So yeah, I've done a couple of pages of revision notes, which is always good just to remember the theory behind it. And then I've done a couple of example questions. La, da, da, da. And then, boom, that is a monster of a question. It's like, it's differentiating, but then it's differentiating with the product rule, but one of the products you then have to differentiate with uh, uh, the chain rule, so it's like double double chain rule. Then you've got a product rule again. That was, that was, that was part of a question, not gonna lie. But because I've sat there and literally devoted such a large amount of time to this chapter, I've well, not much time, I've probably devoted, because I've been playing Minecraft and watching TV at the same time, um, I've probably devoted about an hour or two just to this. I feel that if you throw any of those questions at me, I'll be able to remember how I did it and launch it out into the exam. So tomorrow we'll probably do integrating. Hey, oh god, there's actually quite a lot in this chapter. This will probably take me a long time. It's not, a, it's not a big, it's not a small book, but some of it's easy, like Newton Raphson. <laughs> Else I've been playing Minecraft and watching, um, uh, the re I recorded, what's it called? Uh, le le Planet Earth Live? That's the one. That's a good thing, you get little cute little bears. Little bears going, oh, I just climbed down a tree and I was shivering and I couldn't the in the snow. Bears are awesome. Bears are underrated as animals, I think. <clears throat> okay, then what's going on tomorrow? I'm going to get up at nine. I think the plan's nine. Even though it's going to be good to bed at about two. So, I don't know. I'll wake up naturally, is what I'll go for. Um, if I get up specifically early, then I will plough through more of this chapter here and maybe do a bit more revision around of some other topics. Um, else, I'm going to Lovely's in the late afternoon, after we've both done some work in the morning, or as I shall, I've rested up on sleep, um, at which point I will talk to her about how I can introduce this to people because she'll have an idea. Do you have any ideas? I've been talking to people on Twitter and everything. And I don't even, I can't even help myself. I think that's the bit that I'm now fighting with. It's just forcing myself to do it because I make it harder for myself than it necessarily is. Because at the end of the day, all I have to do is just go, hey guys, I make YouTube videos. Do you mind if I do that now? Lol. Um, that's all I have to do, but I work it up and I want like a really elaborate plan so that I don't have to just outright tell them they can figure it out for themselves. <sighs> So yeah, I'm going to go to bed, I will uh, put you on charge for tomorrow because for some reason your battery's drained in a day and I will catch you later.